so good morning good morning today we will discuss about team work okay what is actually team hmm team in the sense uh, group of uh, some members three four members or some ten twelve members so team is the group of the people or it may be the group of the companies also some companies or some uh, social work groups okay. so like that so many groups will be there that okay. is working as a team okay. team in the sense the people hmm. which are working together with one project okay one ethics hmm? so that you can consider as a team so that all team member will be having only one aim that they want to fulfill that particular things a team player is someone who is able to get along with their challenges and work together continuously with knowledgeable okay so whenever you have any doubts any queries the team people will come together and sit together they will discuss with that problems and they will solve and they will motivate other members that is the main advantage of the working with the team so if you are working if you are doing individually any project uh. so if you want any problems if, if you have any queries uh. so at that time you will be depressed at that time you will be tensed if you are in the team so you can discuss and you can have the knowledge from others and you can solve that particular things whatever you are facing the problems that is the main advantage working in the team so then team building is a very interesting thing where you can share the knowledge valuable knowledge you can say okay. and when you share the knowledge the your team member will get the respect the whatever knowledge you are having and they will collect your knowledge and they will give their knowledge and how to make it in a good manner so that is the main advantage of the team work and the process establishing a developing a greater sense you should have in that particular thing. what is the sense the common sense what you say yeah how to tolerate tolerate the things uh. and you should not reject the what the idea is given by your co-workers just take that idea and just go through that the way that problem it is having you have to consider that things and you have to make him to understand the what thing is wrong and what thing is right okay that thing can be done in that team work and trusting each other you have to have the trust if anyone says your team member is saying like that he is doing like that he is hiding something means you should not dissent that other things other people's what people are saying uh -huh. so just concentrate on what he is doing and what he best he is giving and face to face you have to talk and you have to solve it the whatever doubts you are having in sitting in front of your friends so these are some things are there with the team work so actually this is the main basic things to maintain the team and how it will become the success how the team work will become the success so lot of teams will be there but they will not run the up to that mark up to that project end some will come out from that team fine means discouraging so in that team some people will discourage the person who is having the more interest to explain that particular thing so responsibilities so some people are taking the responsibility some people are not taking the responsibility in the team at that time the team will be collapsed so everyone should take the responsibility the success and failure of that by the team the whatever project you are having hmm? and effective decision can be taken with communication or communicating with all the your group members and you can choose the good things from that particular members so at that time only you can reach that particular goal and you can have the good response from outside and you should have the good relation also with other groups and in in that whatever group members you are having and next thing the skill the what are the skill you need in the team work so first thing is in the team you have to listen properly the what other people are saying in your team so if you listen carefully you can have the idea how to solve that problem how to overcome from that so how he like to what he like to say and what solution he is having if you are not ready to listen your team members you will not you will lose the 
tree team grip so that's why first you have to listen after that you'll have the chance to explain and to that particular thing whether it may be applicable or not whether it is uh, useful that your project or not so like that and respect you have to respect their feeling everyone is having some experience in your team then only you'll cho you have you have chosen that in your team so they are having their own capacity and own their experiences so you have to respect that particular experience what they are having so if you respect with that particular experience they will have the motivated and they will explain and they will have the interest to work on that particular project and questioning so you you can ask the questions also with the whatever questions rise whatever queries you are rising and you have to allow your team members also to asking the questions you should not say you just keep quiet you don't like that means i have the more experience like that so you can take the experience from their generation also so if it is having the generation gap and participate in all the things what events are going in the your surrounding area circumference area so whatever events are going you have to participate in that events and you can take the knowledge and you have to send your uh, team members to participate in that particular event and gather the knowledge the what are the advantages you can take from that and you can take that things so helping each other not even that uh, project helping instead of that if they having any their personal problems in household some problems if it is able to help so you can help them also if they are having some uh, uh, hospital help if they are having some financial help if they are having some other any related their personal household helps so if it is possible you will just you have to help them so and sharing the feeling you can share the feeling by sharing the feeling you will come to each other and you will get the more understand and you will have the more respect to each other and then you can solve that whatever problems is facing by the team projects so and personality will play a very good role in the team so if you have a good personality what is the meaning of good personality so good personality means winning the heart of all your group members how to win that heart of the group uh, your all team members means you should not treat them as your only the team group member you have to treat as a your family members and you have to ask them their problems if they are facing so that will make you good personality you should not try to become only the leader if you may if you want to be may if you want to become a leader means just you they will treat you as leader only if you want to become a one of them they will treat you one of them and they will support you like anything so resource can be used from all the members the all are having different culture all are having the different qualification all are having the different education all your team member is having the unique ideas so you can use that all resources and that feelings and the knowledge whatever knowledge they are having that can be used so to improve your projects so with that you can get the resource from that particular person and common sense what i told so you can use the common sense communication skills and go talking the good manner so very gently giving the respect of that particular so that will play very good uh, uh, work in that particular team buildings and skill and knowledge always you have to motivate to learn the new skills and you can conduct the training from the outsource and you can you can also the whatever as as well that if you having 10 members one is having the very good communication skill one is having a very good in um, legal advice one is having the financial advising so you can take you can conduct some internal training or you can call any other person from uh, outside and resource persons and you can train that people so that you, can, you are improving the skill of your team members that will be help in your so working on like that these are the main things what you can conduct in, uh, in your teams that will motivate and that will increase your team uh, group capacity and like that will be uh, improves and you have to collect accurate informations so the whatever information you are collecting that should be very accurate accurate so that will give the correct result achieving the better quality of the work it will help you to achieve better quality of the work in the whatever work you are having and enthusiasm they will have the more interest to work the people working together can sustain the enthusiasm and lead complete work of each problem so whatever problem they having they will complete achieving the better quality of the life in their aspects also so these are the main things what you should have what you should have 
to maintain the team okay thank you my name is uh, shivyogi ji i'm being